Most of us won't get a chance to celebrate the monumental mm -hmm. anniversary one couple from West Michigan will share today. Yeah, Brittany Flowers sat down with this couple to talk about the life they've built together. Brittany, what did they tell you about their journey to 75 years? Yeah, it's a very special day for Dick and Maxine Rafferty. They're 97 years old, and today they're reflecting on the lifetime of memories they've made together. <laughs> if you want to know the secret to a long and happy life, we're probably the happiest now than we've ever been. Just ask Dick and Maxine Rafferty. We've been very fortunate to and blessed to survive this long. Rewind to 1946. I had just been released from active duty on the West Coast. Dick was taking a train ride home after serving his country as a fighter pilot. I was in uniform. As I walked in the car, I heard this girl say, Hello there. Well, I thought he looked pretty darn handsome in his uniform. <laughs> the couple dated for a year before tying the knot on June 7, 1947. They've been building a life together for 75 years. I was blessed with my three children, and I loved being a mother. I just loved it. And Dick? Well, I'm a trophy husband. <laughs> as many laughs as these two have shared over the years. There's going to be ups and downs in the marriage. They've also had their fair share of challenges. They lost a daughter when she was just 11 years old. If we had bad times, we had bad times. If we had good times, we had good times. And we just ride with it. That loss gave the Rafferty's a new appreciation for family. They now have four grandkids, six great grandkids, and decades of memories to share with them. So many good memories. We've traveled extensively around the world. We like to do everything together. Like any other couple, they don't always see eye to eye. He realizes I'm always right. But they've learned time is too precious to sweat the small stuff. You can't give in to these lows, I might say. You've got to look ahead and say, Things will be better, and they always have been. Dick and Maxine still travel when they're able. They love going on riverboats, hitting the casino at least <laughs> once a week, they say. And Dick still plays golf once or twice a week as well. You just can't help but smile when you hear just what they've been able to experience in their life. Oh, my gosh. I'm sitting there watching this story, just smiling the whole way through. I need to yeah. call the Rafferty's for some advice yeah, on I relationships, know. I'm right? I'm sure they would be willing to share it. <laughs> That is so special. I know my grandparents uh, would bicker with, they were married for 70 years, yeah. and they would bicker with each other, and that was kind of their way. I love how sweet they are with each other, They're too. I wanted to couple. see the differences and how, what makes it work. They did say they do bicker. They just didn't do it while I was oh. there, so. And <laughs> hey, we all do it, right? I mean, we you all love do it. it. Thanks, Good for Brittany. them. Yeah, thank you, Brittany.